I chose the University of Bath because I really liked the project which I applied for. And when I came to visit the university, I was really impressed with the campus and all the facilities and uh, my supervisor and everyone was really positive about what the university had to offer. Um, in our office in the department, there's a whole mixture of PhD students who are on a variety of, working on a variety of different projects. Um, and while the background of our projects is very different, some of the techniques we use is the same. And it means that we can learn off each other and help each other out with things that are new to us. So that's really beneficial. So the title of my thesis is The Effect of Antidepressants and Stress in Juvenile Animals. Um, and adolescent depression or depression in teenagers is a really, really big problem in humans. So up to 12% of teenagers can be affected by depression at some time before they reach the age of 18. Um, and it has huge impact on their lives from education, social life, you know, relationship with their families. And the kind of treatment for that is completely inadequate at the moment because there aren't the medications that are used to treat depression in adults don't work in teenagers. Um, so one of the reasons why this might be the case is to do with the way that the body responds to stress. So what my project is doing is looking at the way the body responds to stress in juvenile mice compared to in adult mice and whether this may account for some of the differences between the treatment of adolescent depression and depression in adults. So most days I spend in the lab and I have two different labs that I work in. The first is um, with animals, so I work in an animal facility and that takes up most of my morning. Um, in the afternoons I have a mixture of other lab work to do which involves analysing samples which I've taken. Um, I also analyse a lot of data and I go to kind of meetings and journal clubs where everyone gets together and discuss kind of the latest research in the field and that kind of thing and that usually takes place around my, the rest of my research. When I finish my PhD I'm hoping to stay in academia and stay in research, ideally doing something very similar to what I'm doing now using some of the same techniques that I've learned during my PhD um, but the kind of research into depression is what really interests me so that's what I'd like to carry on doing. Um, everyone's really friendly, the department's really great and plus the city of Bath is absolutely stunning.